Sir Nimi Pete's, what's up? It's me, John D. Villarreal. Hey, you know I'm the game guy, you know I'm a super genius, you know I'm the super pro when it comes to gaming, and in my personal opinion, to me, Brucey uh, from GTA 4 after me, I've got a bunch of videos on that, everybody knows that's about what's up. Now, here's the thing, I used to host games Pop TV, you know that, you know I've played over 10,000 video games, and you know that I'm a world super pro in games, and the whole situation. Now, I've been playing Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Now, a lot of people love Assassin's Creed like me. Like, at first, I'm like, oh, you know, then you get into it, it's like, whoa, whoa, this is really, really cool. And yeah, it's got it all, dude. It's like, it's like, it's like Da Vinci Code plus like all kinds of other stuff. It, it, it Dungeons and Dragons. It just got so much stuff in it. It's great. But here's the deal. A lot of people were like, wow, I wish it just had multiplayer or online. It never really had that. Now it does, fools. And it's hot. It's really hot. It's very cool. You use a lot of the same strategies that you used before. It's very, very, very tight. And honestly, like the best player wins almost always. You know what I mean? That pretty much, right? You don't get you won't get the same kind of problems you have with, with other online type of situations. Um, still not Battlefield Bad Company Two. That is the best for online multiplayer, in my personal opinion. But it is excellent. Let me show you it right now and why you're gonna love it. Check it out. Your objective is to assassinate assigned targets. Avoid other targets. The little thing at the bottom tells you how close you are. When it fills with, it, that's your direction. When it fills with blue, it shows that, hey, that's your guy or girl. Punk him. Look at that. Immediately getting points. You want to do the same things. You want to, now, someone's after you, so you got to be cool. And you want to try to go stealth sometimes. Watch your target. Contract lost. Someone else got it. So people are watching you constantly too. And they're coming after you. It's very cool though. So people can come after you. It's like do you go fast, do you go slow, you don't want to lose your contract. Contract lost. Sweet. Oh now I got him. Yeah. Did I not tell you that's hot? What, that's what I love. It's like you go stealth in there. And see, what's cool is that like, I, I, I'm pretty sure that different people have the same target. It, it might do something where like the top dudes are more, or people are more targeted and stuff like that. And so you can lose you, your target to someone else and someone else is targeting you. It's like spy versus spy. It's really slick, dude. I really love, I'm looking forward to getting even deeper into it and see what's going on. I mean, when I first started playing this, I was already like really, you know, kick it to rear end here, even though I was like low level and stuff because I'm just good at this stuff. But it's like, it, it gives you the whole stuff. Are you going to be full blast, you know, and, and try to get that kill first, the assassination first? Or are you going to be more stealth and get more points? And, you know, if you go full blast, you might get seen. It's just so much different little strategies that go on to it. You want to stay on the ground, you want to go up high. I love it. That's really cool. So, anyway, that is Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, the multiplayer review. I think it's tight. It's one more reason, and it's a big reason, to go out and get this game right now. Hey, we're Conservative New Media. This is the Video Game Report, and I'm John D. Villarreal, the game god, the super genius, and the former host of GameSpot TV that brings you all of the great video game stuff from the Super Pro. I'll see you next time.